Hey. Santa Claus? What are you doing up in here? Oh, it's a girl. What? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Why is this way better than all of our commercials? You see Alang. What's up with the negative shirt? <laughs> I was looking at that too. <laughs> okay. It was me and my friends on a Friday night. It's catchy. This is like some sort of some sort of noodle or something. Oh, it looks like rice in there. <laughs> <laughs> I like instant food, but uh, this is a little weird. Oh wow, the cowboy here. Okay. Ooh. Oh, looks like Burt Reynolds. <laughs> Why is this way better than all of our commercials? That must be some really good noodles. I felt like everything that was happening was unrelated to each other. So, on a scale from one to five, how likely would you be to purchase that product? Probably like a two. I rate that a two, just because it kind of was all over the place and confusing. I agree with Steph, too. I guess one. I'll give it a five. Yeah. I'll buy that stew. It was a little bit confused by it, so I don't really know if I'd be exactly like rushing to the store <laughs> like a, a two. Give it a five. I'm in, mm -hmm. yes. Five, five, three. I would buy it to try it but I wouldn't like really, I don't have to buy it. So like a three. Like a four, that was pretty good. I don't eat ramen, but you know, that could convince me right there. Hi. Oh, this is cute with a little snowman. Aw, Frosty. I am lost. This better be like another food s'mores commercial. Try not to cry. No. This is absolutely horrific, and whatever they're selling, I don't want anything to do with it. Ah! <laughs> These are making no sense. What, what's he trying to, what are they selling here? Is this a commercial for drum sets? <laughs> what's going on? What are they selling? Like, what is this? So if it's a snowman commercial, I would not buy that snowman, because <laughs> it broke right on the commercial. I will give it points for uh, for throwing me off guard with a sudden shift in, yeah. in like tone and mood. So on a scale from one to five, how likely would you be to buy this based on the ad? One. I think generally it has to be like, this is what we're selling, this is why you need it. That's all I need to know. I'd probably give that a one. I'll give it a two. A one. Maybe like a three, because I think they did a good job, but... It was also just so confusing. I'll give it a zero. That must have been hard to make that snowman move, so. A plus for that. I give it a one. One. Yeah. Solid one. Was that like a zero? I'll give it a two. One, because I don't know what I'm buying. I'll give it a five. Screw it. <laughs> one. <laughs> Again, I'm gonna be with Steph on this one. I'm not copying off you, but I don't know what we were buying there. <laughs> Muscle hustle. Oh, is this like a workout thing? Instant abs? A, you look like that. Mm. Is this a strength backpack? I don't think it's a back brace. Add weight, maybe? He's stronger now. I like this commercial the most. They've explained what it is. Okay. I feel I, like yeah, it's some suit better. that helps like distribute weight that you're carrying down to your legs or something. <laughs> Fighting Godzilla for some reason? Hi. Long time. Uh, what the? Well, that kind of got dark. Oh, that's actually the product. Muscle suit. Yeah, it's ex exoskeleton got of it. some kind. Yeah, I actually need one of those. I'm I'm a gamer, so I'm slouching here this whole video. I'll give it a four. I I feel like that that was actually. May be very useful. I don't care how good your commercial is. I hate buying your scoliosis machine. So that's a one. Yeah, that's a one. Yeah, I'll give it a three. I would try it. I would not buy it. That's one star. A three for me, dog. Definitely a five. <laughs> Best commercial I've ever seen. I think I'm going to give it a three. Five yeah. out of five. I'm mm -hmm. there. Five out of five. Three. It's a thing where I'm like, good commercial. I, didn't, I wouldn't buy it, though. I'll give it a four. I don't have back problems, but I understood that commercial pretty well, so I will give it a four. I would not buy that product because <laughs> it looks weird, so I'm going to give it a two. Oh, pretty. Christmas lights. This looks cool. Oh, he's got a stalker. They got a stalker. Is it going to be a phone? Is it going to be a camera? Santa Claus? What are you doing up in here? Oh, he's dating Santa? I was gonna say, he's having an affair with Santa. What is going on here? <laughs> oh, it's a 
a girl. What? Ah! Oh, no. Merry Christmas. And there's a dog in a hat. The dog was a oh, nice touch. So after watching a, a lady rip her man suit off, I, I want to buy a phone that comes with 50 gigabytes. How do I decide if I want to buy something if the, nothing was presented to me? On a scale from 1 to 5, how likely would you use the service? Again, probably a 1. Maybe like a 2? I'm going to give it a 3. I'm going to give it a 1. I'm going to give it a 1. 2, I guess? I'd give this one a 3. This one actually held my attention. I think I'm going to have to go with another 1. I'll give it a 2. I like that dog. Yeah, like a 2. Yeah, I'll give it a 2. We were, we were on the right track, Okay. I guess. Yeah. 5 again. It was perfect. Probably That's four, awful. because uh, if Santa Claus did it to me, I'd probably go ahead and buy the cell phone service, too. Oh, I love Square Enix! Here we go. Oh, what is... Oh! Super Giant gerbil! Super is that a... Super marshmallow? What is that thing? Oh, evil candles. Dang, okay. Is this for a game? <gasps> Those are so cute! <laughs> There's so much happening. Like, I'm just so confused. This looks really fun, though. Oh, no! Oh! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> Wait, it looks like a game, like App Store. I'm assuming it's some kind of game that I'm not entirely sure I want to play. It's weird because that seemed like the most normal one to me. It did, yeah. That seemed kind of like what I would have expected coming into this video. I'd be curious to see what the game's about, you know? I'm like, I feel like it's like a Candy Crush. Three. It was interesting and it caught my attention. I like where that monster was trying to eat the kid. <laughs> So I'll give it a, a three as well. Five. Two. I didn't see any gameplay. Again, one. It was very weird. People seemed pretty happy. I'll, I'll give it like a three. Yeah, I was going to say, like a four. I'd, I'd play that game. It looks cute. Maybe like a two. Five out of five. Yeah, five. Mm -hmm. Clear as day. Give it a one. I'll give it a four. Five. I would play that game. I'd try it out. So I guess it's a five. A chili pepper. Like a shampoo ad, maybe? Hot sauce? Where are y'all going? Us! That's us! <laughs> That's us! It's terrible CGI. <laughs> oh, they're delivering peppers to all the good boys and girls. I've given you the chili. Oh! oh. Was that a cup? What? What is that? I like the design. Yeah. It's shaped like a pepper. That's yeah. cute. I'll give it like a... It's two. It made more sense than the others. I would give it another four. I, I feel like I want to save the five for something that's just really over the edge. I haven't seen it yet. Three, maybe? Yeah, i give it a three. A four. So regardless of how good the commercial yeah. is, I would not purchase the product. Four. Okay. I'll give it a two because, you know, it was kind of funny in the beginning. A two. I'm going to go to a one. It's going to have to be a one. The commercial explained nothing, so I have to buy it to understand what it is. So five again. OK, I would default to five in that situation. Oh, dude, what? teamwork what? makes a dream work. I'll give it a four. I like my spicy stuff. I want to give it a five just so I can find out what it is. Like, I'm, I'm intrigued. <gasps> Food. Food. We love the chicken. Interesting. <laughs> I want to know what that audition process was like. What? What is going on? On a scale from one to five, how likely would you be to purchase this product? Two. Well, it was food, so I'm automatically gonna give it a four. Maybe a two. Five stars. Five stars. Five. Yeah, I, I like all the wrestlers. I heard the food in the Japanese convenience stores are like amazing, so maybe Gee. I'll buy it. Maybe I'll bump it to a, a two. I'll bump it to a two. Four. Could be clearer. I'll give it a five. We're giving that a two. I don't think I'd really buy this. Yeah. It's a little too angry for me. A four, because I loved their energy. They were super hyped up. I'd give it a four, even close to a five, because I could use to get some built up. <laughs> so if they're doing it, I'm going to try it. Right? <laughs> oh, Attack on Titan! I was just watching this. And Snickers? Oh my gosh, this might be a five. Oh, I'm in! Okay, yes! Okay, here we go. <laughs> Mom? Mom, I'm sorry! 
This is like these are like avatars and stuff, right? Anime. Oh, anime. Yeah. Oh my God, Snickers is wilding out, man. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. See, you're not you when you're hungry. This looks like a fan edit. This looks like somebody yeah, on looks, YouTube. It looks like some just YouTube made a garbage. fan edit. And it's like a weird kind of... I kind of like it, though. I feel like a lot of American commercials try to pull on your heartstrings and, and be a little, like, cute or sad sometimes. And these were just crazy, wacky fun. Yeah. And faster, too. They were really quick. They're just taking yeah. themselves way too seriously over here. Mm -hmm. I don't have time for that. So, on a scale from one to five, how likely would you be to purchase that product? You know what? I'd give it a five. It, it, it's Snickers. I mean, come on. I'm going to rate that one a five. A four. Why Just four? because I don't like Snickers, but everything else is pretty good. <laughs> four. I'll give it a three. Five. One out of five for me, but Snickers itself is like a three out of five for me. I actually think that was a pretty cool ad. We'll give it a five. Why not? Five. Like a five. Yeah, that one was good. That gets a five for me. That gets a five. Maybe because we're already so familiar with Snickers. I'm familiar with Attack on Titan as well. And so I'm like, ooh, great crossover. Oh my gosh, that was that was perfect for me. Five all the way. Japanese commercials have been popular on YouTube for many years, and even the most recent compilations continue to get millions of views. So as a creator yourself, what do you think it is about these commercials that's made them so popular on YouTube for such a long time? Yeah, you know what, I think because they're very quick and like very, you know, there's a lot going on. So when there's a lot going on, it's like, oh, whoa, whoa, this is happening, that's happening, that's happening. And then by the time it's over, you're like, wait, what What just happened? I gotta watch it again. They don't make any sense. It's like this like f dangling keys in front of a baby. I think they're just, they're sort of nonsensical where you're so confused that it almost makes it more intriguing. I think people like to get little glimpses into other cultures that are totally unfamiliar to them and commercials are a easy, quick way to do that, get that consumption. It kind of embodies pop culture and media in the sense that it's just fast, it's fun, there's bright colors, lots of stuff in your eyeballs, fun music, it just totally gets you psyched and, and wanting to be a consumer. Thank you for watching this episode of YouTubers React. Subscribe to all the creators featured in this episode. Links are in the description below. All right, all right thanks, thanks again. again. Sayonara. Sayonara. Hey guys, I'm Jesse, associate producer here at FBE. Thanks to all the creators who came in to shoot this episode today. Make sure to support them by subscribing to their channel. Links are in the description below. Bye guys.